What's up, Gaming Nation? Welcome back to Seven Days to Die. I'm Game, and today we are continuing our Navisgain Reveal playlist. Today, I am showing you guys toilets to go. I'm just kidding. Just kidding. We're looking at the working sticks. That's right. If you guys need some tools, check this out. All right, guys, and remember, with this series, I am going through the entire Navisgain map. I'm trying to reveal every major location that you may need to check out. So make sure that you guys check out the playlist. It should be up here and in the description below, and it will have all of the different items that you guys need, whether it is working stiffs, shotgun messiah, if it's shamway or poppin' pills, whatever you need, I have a playlist for you. So today we are checking out the Working Stiffs tools. The first location that we're looking at is in the town that we visited many times in this little series. It is the most northwestern town in the winter biome. Now, if you're looking for relativity, it is just northwest of Dyersville. And this is Trader Jen. And here is the other trader that's right across from Jen as well. Now this location is pretty cool because it does have a poppin' pills, a shamway, and I think a crack -a book down there somewhere. So we visited this location before, uh, so it's a great town to visit and get a bunch of things all at once. And if you guys are needing toilets, it's right here. It's right there. Get it. So guys, here's the coordinates if you guys want to check this location out for yourself. And with this playlist, I'm going to try not to reveal any of the secrets of the POI or anything too much to spoil it for you guys. But here is a quick view of this location. Looks like you guys could jump up here or just go straight through the area here. But remember, with this location, it's actually a bunch of POIs connected together. So you can go into just the working stiffs, but you can also actually go into one or all of these stores and get a little bit more loot uh, for your bang as well. So this location is fairly small. Going through this particular location, if you guys just went through this working stiffs, probably 10 minutes if at the most. If you guys went through the entire area here, which is all kind of connected together, maybe a little bit longer, but this is a great location nonetheless. All right, guys, the next one on the list, here it is on the map. It is actually in the same town that we were just in. Here are the rough coordinates if you want to come check this place out. And the location we were at previously was just right down the street. So it is literally a hop, skip, and a jump away from where we just were. And there's more tools here. So this location is a little bit bigger, of course. It does have the actual store area and then this little hardware section here a hopefully working vending machine for you guys as well and plenty of holes to go into this place and a little thing out back as well so this location is definitely one to come check out if you guys are needing some tools or anything else i believe this location does have main loot which is the reinforced chest which is nice um a little bonus on top of whatever else you guys get all right, guys, our next location is one of the bigger department stores, so to speak. This location is in the desert town. It is the most southeastern town that you guys can get in the desert. There's a really good amount of things around this location. And here are the rough coordinates for this location. And a quick fly around this location. It is a little bit bigger, which is great because that just means more loot for everyone. This one definitely has some main loot or reinforced chest, but it is a bigger location. Might take you guys half a day, depending on your play style, depending on your speed and everything else. But there's definitely good things to be had in this location. All right, guys, so now also in the desert, this location's a little bit different. It is actually Lathan's Hardware, but it's still a hardware store. So if you're looking for a hammer or a tool or whatever it is you're looking for, you still could find it at this location. So I wanted to throw this as a little bonus for you guys. This one is just southwest of the town that we were just in. It is kind of the middle of the map in this little cove. This is a small little uh, mining town, so to speak, or a little ghost town. If you guys checked out our crack -a book uh, Navisgain map reveal, we revealed this location with a Coles Books, which is basically the same thing. So here, the location on the map, if you guys want to check it out. 
and here is a quick run through of this location it is a very small one maybe 20 minutes 10 minutes the most but should have some good loot for you guys hopefully a chest or two that you guys just might need and the awesome thing is there's many small locations all throughout here that you guys can definitely come check out as well and then knock it all out at once come here break the entire town apart and then go back to base all right guys last but certainly not least one of my favorite locations especially for the working stiffs this one is just right west of dyersville northeast ish of trader gen this one is central to the map a little bit north i guess central northeast but this one is a great location. Here is the coordinates if you guys want to check this one out. And if we want to do a quick fly through, this location is massive. It's amazing. This one has a little gardening section over here, which has plenty of cobblestone and cement and also soil if you guys need those from the plants. It has the actual storefront location here. And then it's got this entire fenced in back area, which is awesome. This little area back here, these walls are concrete, which is great. And it's got a little cool little uh, door on it. Cannot operate it, but it just looks awesome. That would be pretty cool to have at your base. And this is a location you guys could make your base if you really wanted to. However, forewarning, it is a very large location, but this one definitely has some main loot for you guys if you're looking for that and also plenty of boxes to get your auger your claw hammer your wrench whatever you guys need this is the location for you so thank you guys so much for watching until the end i really truly appreciate it and remember to check out this series where we're revealing all of the different locations in navis game if you guys liked the video drop a like if you loved it consider subscribing if you have anything to say put it down in the comments below and i'll see you next time peace